Every day, crowds of workers are being bussed into this Beijing museum to receive COVID-19 vaccinations. The Chinese government aims to vaccinate 50 million people by the middle of this month. After vaccinating essential workers, we'll move to ordinary people. We estimate it will take about half a year to finish Beijing's population. Security guards, delivery and transport workers are among those instructed to receive the jabs. Two to three thousand people are inoculated at this Beijing vaccination center every day. The Chinese government has prioritized certain industries in its first phase of its mass vaccination rollout. And for many of the people who come here, it's their employer who has organized their visit. But experts say China needs to speed up its vaccination rollout. And a lack of widespread infection means a slower development of herd immunity among the population, which may not be achieved until late 2022. China can vaccinate 50 million people by mid-February, no problem. But it doesn't mean much. It's only one third of total population. Maybe only after 500 million are inoculated, we'll see the difference. China can't afford to relax. There are also fears Beijing won't have enough doses for its 1.4 billion population. China has promised 10 million doses to COVAX, an international alliance distributing vaccines to developing countries. It's also exporting about 400 billion to countries such as Brazil and Indonesia, and donating millions more to allies, including Pakistan. The discovery of a counterfeit vaccine ring in the southern province of Jiangsu earlier this month has also undermined confidence in vaccine safety. Authorities say all fake doses have been tracked down. The Chinese government attaches great importance to safeguarding the security of the vaccines and will continue to crack down on vaccine-related crimes. The government is also under pressure to roll out vaccines ahead of the National People's Congress, the nation's largest leaders gathering in March, and preparations for the 2022 Winter Olympics. Beijing has high hopes both the Olympics and its vaccines will help improve its international image in the wake of the pandemic. But while questions about China's role in the outbreak remain unanswered, its borders are still closed, and its people await their turn to receive a vaccine. Katrina Yu, Al Jazeera, Beijing.